Hi guys, it's New Sals here. Um, some of you may know me better as Maria, or indeed by my real name, which is Vi. I'm not even going to be spelling how to spell with my first name. Um, so either New Sals or Maria will do fine. Um, I believe I'm taking over the video for Fridays. Um, and this week's theme is 20 items um, in our personal space. Um, I'd also like to warn you that my camera just randomly autofocuses from time to time. There's not much you can do about it. I could turn it off, but then I feel I'd be m more blurry half the time than I would be you know, when it's trying to focus. So I'll just leave it be. My first item, this red panda thing. Demon red panda. Second thing, this bottle opener. I have a bottle opener because I was out one night with one of my friends. We bought ciders. Um, we are in the supermarket. The only thing that I anything that vaguely remembered, you know, sort of resembled this sort of ball opening bit, um, was this. So we had to buy it before we get our drinks open. And this hairbrush. Hairbrush. There you go. Hairbrush. Hair clip. Um, decorative little hair clip. Wear it at the back of my head sometimes. This black rose um, is a clip-on little thing. It was to go with my prom dress, which was black and white. So naturally black roses, but I never ended up using it in the end. Incredibly old Digimon Tamagotchi. It's that, you know, I haven't used this for years. It goes off. I forget to feed it, and it's really annoying. Probably some sort of collectible, I don't know, some sort of collectible item these days, but... <laughs> to be honest, I'm more likely to throw it out than anything. Bunny ears! Got them a few Easter's ago, um, just because it was Easter, I guess. Slippers. Just really just taking stuff I can find now. One of those things I have is camcorder, obviously. Um, where is it? Yeah. Camcorder. Yeah, mine's, that's what my camcorder looks like. I can't obviously show you it because I'm recording with it. That's pretty simple, really. Metronome. Um, very old school, sort of, you wind it up, it goes tick, 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 and it gets really quite annoying sometimes, uh, especially when it starts to slow down randomly. You're really trying to set speed. Um, there's an old story behind this metronome. Another thing would be this laptop case. Now, it doesn't look very interesting. To be honest, it's kind of black, it's kind of boring. And I'd agree with you. But, you haven't seen the cool side. It's all patterny. It's quite pretty, really. Um, my brother got me this for Christmas this year. Yeah, so that might be easier. Um, my brother got me this for Christmas. Um, this year it would be, and um, for my new laptop, which I got. Um, I always talked about taking like one of those laptops with the cool designs, but it's like a hundred pounds more expensive, and I was like, I'll spend a hundred pounds on a decorative cover, especially since it doesn't do anything for it. And so my brother bought me this. And it was just as good. It was a really lovely surprise. I'm going to be quite honest with you. I have no idea what the hell this is. I get what it looks like. But I have no idea what the hell it actually is. This little tree. Uh, it's made of some sort of, I don't know, purpley stone. And it's got a salt base. Now, I got this one on a school trip. And you may see the name of that. That's the name of the Polish mine which it came from. I can't even begin to pronounce it, sorry. <laughs> um, I was there for a couple of days and I bought this as a souvenir to get home. Once again, focus. I run things, I only use this big lion. He's actually not that big, it's sort of deceptive. I'm behind it and it's the front, so like, oh, it's a big lion. Ah. Yeah, he's not really that big. Um, yeah. So, I got this when I was about nine. Um, every year one of these shops um, does like big huge cuddly toy things. Now the year of which, when it was made, in this case it was 999, so it was actually eight. I'm sorry, I've lied to you. Um, this is one, I had a couple of others after this one, but this was the only one that really stuck. I've got rid of all the other ones. I really love this line. He's so cute, look at his face. How do you read his face? So cute, isn't he? Aww. He's one pet. Another random thing I own is this pig. Um, very interesting story behind this pig. Um, 
it's a pig, obviously. Um, if you get the snake, which comes with the pig, you scrape it along its back, apparently it sounds like it's oinking. Whether it actually sounds like it's oinking or it's frog croaking, I'll let you decide. I'm not going to keep doing that. It's annoying. It's running out of things. Another thing that I own is this flute. Anyway, this is my flute. I've been playing flute. I've had flute last. Oh, hello, for now. For I've had flute last for about seven years now. Um, yeah. <laughs> I've been playing the piano for about ten years, and um, flute for about seven-ish. Sorry when my brother started getting flute lessons, and my parents thought would give me piano lessons. Well, I actually wanted to do the accordion. The piano was a good enough substitute for that, apparently. Look at that. He's not cute. There's also this pig. He, um, I don't know if you'll see it, but he walks and oinks at the same time. That's it. Yeah, it's quite loud and can be quite irritating sometimes. My other random thing is this pound note. Now, in Britain these are not legal tender anymore, they stopped being legal tender about a year, two years, three years ago maybe. But my auntie decided she had two lying around, she gave one to me and one to my brother. To be honest, I think she rather would have had the pound coin. She was just trying to cough off and get rid of them on us. But hey ho, what a lovely Christmas present. Rather long. I don't know how I can shorten a whole shot. It's not like my neck's being intercepted by a big long silver thing. It was interesting that we had them um, needed one of those ends to open the lids. Very technical. <laughs>